Based on forecasts, it looks like Shiba Inu is about to go on a crazy bullish run. This is supported by an indicator. And in today's video, we'll be talking about it. Another Shiba and Utopian will also have some intriguing news to share. Thus, be sure not to miss the SHIB Army's what's up. As I said previously, a signal has been seen that essentially indicates that the price of SHIB is set to soar. SHIB has recently been in decline. However, analysts have noted that it is currently in consolidation as it attempts to rebound from its recent decline. SHIB appears to just need to break through a specific resistance level in order to move higher. Yet given everything that Shiba Inu is now dealing with, that doesn't seem like such a big deal. Analysts concur that SHIB prices are likely to increase and return to a higher trend line. Nobody anticipates this occurring overnight. Some claim that the prices need to properly adjust and turn bullish after two months. Having said that, I want to think that they haven't considered the fact that Shiba Eternity is scheduled to premiere on Saturday. Such an event ought to be sufficient to drastically alter SHIB's price. This is particularly feasible if we genuinely consider the launch day to be the suggested download day, with thousands of people downloading the game simultaneously. We can spread a lot of information about the game and help it climb the App Store rankings. As a result, more people become aware of it and download it. A price reaction typically happens when there is greater buzz surrounding a cryptocurrency. Depending on the type of buzz after hearing that, you may be considering whether it's time to form a huddle. But I can't make that decision for you. Yet, there are a few things you might want to think about before choosing. First of all, SHIB had a really good previous 24 hours. So much so that it was able to recoup part of the loss it suffered when it took a plunge. He claims that the price of crypto Shiba Inu Sherbarium has recently been on the rise with increases of more than 2% over the previous 24 hours. This has effectively reduced its losses over the previous 7 days to just about 1.63, even though it is still more than 60% below its all-time high. Subsequent actions have gotten favorable feedback from its owners. Yet there are still additional factors to take into account. The first. Because Shiba Inu has been accepting new holders virtually every day since June, the number of SHIB addresses just appears to be on the rise. And with everything that Shiba Inu is currently up to, people from outside the ecosystem have been flowing in in large numbers. It does not appear like the growth of users will slow down anytime soon. SHIB burns have also risen, both through the SHIB portal and through a variety of additional portals. The SHIB army has kept coming up with new ways to burn SHIB, some of which don't require you to give up the tokens in your personal portfolio. Also, it has been revealed that both Burying Him, which will launch soon, and Shiba Forever, which will launch this Saturday, will have components that aid in burning SHIB. As a result, the community is steadily reducing the amount of circulating supply, and SHIB even appears to be preparing for a bullish run. The charts indicate this, at least. Crypto, in his opinion. Observing the RSI over a 24-hour period. The DMI on the same time frame showed the signal line and a positive die resting barely over 20, both indicating a declining bearish trend and the potential beginning of a bullish one. Although the general trend was still bearish, it was diminishing. I previously stated that SHIB needs to break past its current resistance level in order to start a bullish run. It appears that in order for SHIB to overcome this resistance level, the current purchasing pressure must continue. SHIB can then continue on an upward trend after crossing this resistance level and forming a new support. Given that several projects are about to be completed, it should be possible for the buying pressure to remain in place. Speaking of the push to buy if you're thinking about purchasing some SHIB tokens or any other type of cryptocurrency, your best bet for quick, easy transactions is Fairdesk. Also, you receive a number of intriguing perks such as a 4% bonus on your first three days of transactions. As a result, give it a look. That being said, this is not financial advice. Since the mining of bones was capped at 230 million and that cap was reached, the scramble for tokens has reached a new level, and more and more people are trying to buy what is available. As a result, please do not take the decision to huddle or not to huddle as being completely yours but you should consider doing some research before taking a step as significant as that. 
and as a result, the cost of bone has skyrocketed, so much so that Wells have begun to take notice. In addition, many different cryptocurrency exchanges have been listing bone, including Switcher, Mexican Exchanges, FCF Pay, and Bluebird. Then, to top it all off on Dex Tools, Bone is currently surging on another exchange that just launched it. The top cryptocurrency is currently approaching $2 when compared to the price of a bone. And as the debut of Sherbarium approaches, we can shortly arrive at that. Let's move on to the latest cryptocurrency news. Right now, Bitcoin is trading for a pitiful $19,000 which is virtually a record low. Both analysts and traders appear to be very concerned about this. Furthermore, there doesn't seem to be much hope that Bitcoin won't keep losing value. But it appears that everyone will be watching how Bitcoin performs this week to see if it will rebound or just keep falling in answer to a Twitter question on what comes next. Alex Kruger predicted that cryptocurrency will outperform after it bounces back because it had been displaying relative strength in a lower than higher rerun of the June CPI week for stocks. Strong spot buys over the past two days have equaled a new multi-week low. So, do you agree or disagree with what I said? Tell us in the comments area, please. Yet, some analysts appear to believe that BTC is going through a bear to bull transition. These analysts have been focusing on the relationship between price, supply, and profit with regard to BTC. Now, according to News BTC, the supply and profit metric is a metric that assesses the proportion of the total Bitcoin supply that is currently holding some profit. The metric operates by examining each coin's on-chain history to determine its last selling price. If this selling price is lower than the current BTC value for any coin, then that particular coin currently holds some unrealized profits. We can determine whether or not the two metrics have been trending in the same direction by looking at the correlation between the price of Cryptus and its supply and profit. Thus, the correlation values for Bitcoins are often higher than 0.9. Nonetheless, the coin's value typically hovers around 0.75 during periods of transition between bear and bull markets, and vice versa. BTC is predicted to transition from being bearish to being bullish given that it is currently in a bearish place. But let us know what you think in the comments section below. This brings us to the conclusion of the video. Please like this video if you appreciate it, and don't forget to leave a comment in the space provided. I find that the YouTube algorithm is greatly aided by this. Likewise, if you can, spread the word about this video as widely as you can. Let's spread the word about this.